The erosive power of a glacier is made easier by any cracks in the surface of the land which it flows over, which may have been made through freeze-thaw weathering before the glacier formed. When it does flow over a landscape, broken rocks and stones become frozen onto the base or sides of the glacier. As the glacier flows downhill, this material is pulled from the ground and transported with it. This process, called plucking, leaves behind a jagged landscape. As more rocks and debris are embedded into the ice, the base and sides of a glacier become rougher. As the glacier flows, it drags this material across the landscape and acts like sandpaper, wearing it down and leaving behind smooth, polished surfaces. This process is called abrasion. During abrasion, a glacier may scratch the landscape. These scratches, called striations, can still be seen today. A glacier, like water, flows downhill via the easiest route it can find. When a glacier flows down a V-shaped valley, it widens and deepens it, creating a U-shaped valley. And that was Glacial Erosion in a Minute.